folks. So I have switched from the red cam to the blue cam, the window and door. This is why, mostly because I'm gonna be using Spyro. So I take a toothpick, and I go around and punk, poke a bunch of holes. You gotta let it sit for a bit so it, the top layer hardens. Sorry, I was out of focus. All right. Poke a bunch of holes. Then you go in and you push it down. You don't want to push it down too far, but there is a gap in there that you can eliminate. Especially if you want to like, like I just poked this part down. So now that'll be a feature So yeah, it'll still have enough like room to um, so I can pin stuff to it. I usually have to go in and and you and push in a toothpick and a toothpick at an angle. I'm just gonna leave that one like that because it's closing off the but I'll come in here and push some of this down because I want the frogs to be able well I don't know like this tank is gonna be it's not gonna be habit habited for a little bit. I'm just gonna let it grow in for a, a long time. So this could be a little passageway for the frogs. Or Maybe I might just put micro geckos in here. Haven't decided yet. Just been stressed out lately and wanted to do a build. You gotta be careful sometimes because sometimes you push it a little bit too far. See, I pushed that a little bit too far. Now it's caved in. And since I'm going to be using Spyro, I'm not going to have to carve any of this. Which is a really great thing. The Spyro is on its way along with... I already got the glass piece. But the ventilation system will be drilling on the top and putting ventilation holes. And then I'm going to go ahead and drill my holes for my misting system in the future. But I ordered some plugs that will go in there. But yeah, I just wanted to share this little method with everybody. It's a pretty cool method. But down here at the bottom, you definitely want to push it in really tight. It helps the spira. Because once I trim this straight, it'll be flat. Right, anyways, I'm gonna I'm gonna go and finish doing this. Yeah, that's a neat little method if anybody wants to try it.